Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Your Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Tuesday, March. Is it the second or the first? I can't even remember. Give me a second. Ooh. The second. <laughs> I have no concept of time most of the time, so that's okay. Anyways, uh, look, look, I finished it. This is like a sneak peek. I finished my second cardigan. I'm so excited with it. Okay. Anyways, I'm doing some. some I get to talking too fast. Y'all gonna have to tell me to slow down sometimes. But in a nice way, because if you're rude to me, I'm probably gonna be rude back to you. So, because I'm getting tired of people's bull crap. Anyways, I'm 30 years old. I'm too, I'm getting too old to like care what people think about me. Do I care? Does it affect my life? No, it does not. Anyways, shout outs. Got two YouTube channels for today and an Etsy shop. So, I know a lot of people here who is watching me <laughs> crochet. Uh, because it's a crochet channel. <laughs> so, you might not want to buy someone's crocheted items. But you can still support them and the way you can support Etsy shops that sell crochet items instead of patterns or like project bags or stitch markers is going to that shop, clicking the little heart button, favoriting it and favoriting their items because that helps them get seen by more people. The more favorites that an item or a shop has, it pops up more often when people are searching for things. So if you want to support people who have crochet items for sale, you can just favorite their shops even if you never buy anything because you know like me i crochet all kinds of things so i'm probably not going to buy a crochet item from anyone but i can still go and favorite their shop and favorite their items and that helps get them boosted so i'm just telling you that little tidbit and that's like if you sew like i sew so you're probably never going to buy a project bag from me you could still favorite my shop to help it get seen or if you write patterns you know you can do that with anything if you make stitch markers still favorite stitch marker makers shops and items so that they get boosted yeah, anyways, I wanted to say that because this, this shop that I'm sharing today sells crochet items instead of like patterns or stitch markers or project bags or anything that has to do with the craft <laughs> other than the actual craft itself. <laughs> but anyways, the two YouTube channels that I'm shouting out today are that were left in the comments of the last uh, shout out video. So if you want me to shout out your um, channel or shop or anything like that, leave it in the comments and then I will take them from the comments and do that in the next shout out video. Uh, and then I'll probably pick up some random ones along the way as I find new ones, you know. So the two YouTube channels <laughs> are Ladybird Loves, and it's a YouTube channel. I already said that, I already said that. <laughs> and Crochet Creations by Christy. I really enjoy Christy's channel. She does a lot of things where you can get involved with her. She does a lot of crochet alongs and stuff. And um, I honestly never thought about giving her a shout out before because I watch her a lot. So I just kind of assumed other people do too, you know, like that happens. But even big channels like me, so you know, some there's people out there that don't know who I am, don't know I exist. So even larger channels need shout outs too, and the small ones. And Christy's got like 700 subscribers, I believe. So she's getting close to the 1,000 milestone. So I definitely check out those two channels, uh, Ladybird Loves and Crochet Creations by Christy. <laughs> They'll be linked in the description. And then the Etsy shop is a brand new one. Um, she just started her shop a few days ago. <laughs> she actually used my... Um, referral link or whatever it's called so she got some free listings 40 i think and i got 40 free listings for my Etsy shop but anyways her shop is called peacock yarn creations she's only got two items in there right now but um if you're not interested in buying crochet things because you crochet you can still go favorite her shop and her items just to help get them boosted but yeah i already favorited her shop when she she first told me she made it i went and directly <laughs> like immediately went and favorited, favorited it it's hard to say check out these two channels and the Etsy shop. And if you have any suggestions for anybody to check out new channels, or if you have one, or if you have a Facebook group, or Instagram, or Etsy shop, or you like your own personal shop, it doesn't have to be Etsy shop. Um, I can't think of any other. Jesse's making noises. Any other like venues. But if you have anything to do with any kind of fiber arts, whether it's knitting, crocheting, loom knitting, weaving, dyeing yarn, making project bags, stitch markers, uh, these things your <laughs> yarn bowls yarn cozies any of that stuff leave in the comments and i'll give you a shout out in a future shout out video and then people can also just look in the comments and check you out if they want to but yeah so y'all need to help everybody stand up against bullies <laughs> because bullies are real so don't shy away from them stand up to them let them know that you're not gonna take their crap anymore and that um I mean, they can say whatever they want that's that's free you know people have freedom of speech about stuff like that whatever but they don't have the freedom or the right to make you feel bad about yourself or to make you feel like you're doing something wrong even though you're just having the time of your life. <laughs> if they can't stand to see you happy, that's something that's wrong with them. 
not with you. People are screwed up who don't like seeing people happy. So just remember that. Yeah, that's my TED Talk for today.